Hey guys. I'm back. Remember me? Iceland tattoos art. Um, I've been up to a lot of things and I may or may not be back depending. Um, but right now I'm here to talk to you guys about what I've been thinking about a lot recently and that is quests. So recently me and my partner were listening to a great fantasy audiobook full of challenge, heroes overcoming adversity and persevering against all odds, excitement, drama, and as any really good story will, it made us kind of bummed about our own lives because it's this feeling of being like early 20 year old, having the world at your fingertips, having so much potential, so much exciting things to do, the infinite options out there to grab hold of and then just not knowing how to get any of those or how to start the process or how to even find something that you actually care enough about to put all of your energy into it and follow down whatever trail that leads you. And we've been listening to all these really awesome podcasts by Joe Rogan and Aubrey Marcus and all of them just talking about like going and getting it and looking at life as a game and all of these really interesting ideas. But one of the ideas that kind of stuck was Aubrey Marcus did this podcast with Eric Godsey and they talk about the game of life and how there's all these different levels to life and if you think of it as like a video game or some sort of role playing game you're like building your character, finding your friends, doing like do going on quests, gaining skills and powers and all of these things but he's talking about the first thing that you do being forging your machine and that's getting your body to a level that's as fit and healthy as you possibly can. And so, while we're both in this kind of mental funk of just not having anything cool to go out and really try hard at and do, um, we started thinking about, okay, so there's all these like adventures out there, all of these cool things that you can try and accomplish in your life, but what can you do right now while you're trying to pay rent and pay bills or going to college, don't have a bunch of time to go out and fully devote yourself to, say, studying martial arts or fully devoting yourself to exploring the wilderness all day, every day, or whatever these things are. What can you do that fits into your life right now that you can just make part of your daily existence and make into a routine that is part of your life but is also something that you can work and strive for and look at in the form of a cool story quest instead of like the normal take of like, oh, this is a 30 day challenge or whatever it is and see how you can make that evolve and grow and transform into something that will in fact serve you forever. I personally wanted something that would make me feel good every day even if I didn't have a project that I'm working on at the time or didn't have some big business thing to kind of sink my teeth into, something that I could focus on as a daily ritual that would be like, all right, didn't do the art I wanted to today, but I did get to level up my brain and body a little bit more, getting to that next level of just overall health and well-being. So that's how it played into my thought process. And so, this is what we came up with. Choosing a quest is the first thing. And the quest that we chose was the body project. It is here as a young adult getting your body, and mine hopefully, as fit as you possibly can. Because if you want to actually really try at something and don't know what it is that you want to try at or what you want to learn about or are just generally overwhelmed by the unending possibilities that exist in the universe, then 
your body is a pretty good place to start. So we don't have a law on here so far because again, it is just phase one, but I'm gonna be filling it in and I'm gonna be showing you guys how it grows and changes along my own journey. And again, a lot of people do things like this. A lot of people have done it better, have done it more in depth, have done it more scientifically, more spiritually, more whatever it is. This is just my version, my own representation of what a journey story through trying to take something and level it up, take your own body and level it up is going to be. So the first thing we have on here is wake up early and do yoga. And that's our morning routine so far. But hopefully things will get added to that. And so the general idea for week one is going to be 6 a.m. alarm, 20 minutes yoga, runs a few times a week, no alcohol, eating healthy and cheap because as most 22 year olds, we are on a budget. And then these are just some other general ideas that we have about what to do. But basically, this is the beginning. And I don't know where it's going, but it's going somewhere. And I am just putting this out there because if there are other people who are wanting to do something, wanting to do the kind of body challenge, but see it represented in a weird artistic visual way, then this might be the thing for you. Thanks for staying tuned. Thanks for hanging around during my long hiatus of life. And I hope that I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you want to. Like if you want to. Dislike if you want to. Good vibes. Love you guys.